So what do you get when you combine this grinder, which is amazing at breaking up rock nodes, with a free-floating arm mechanism, which is fantastic at breaking up rock pieces that are already on the ground. You get this unstoppable mining machine, or um, for short. Its small grinder breaks up even the toughest nodes, while a drill arms process even the smallest bits on the ground. The three-wheel layout keeps the mechanism level with the ground at all times, and combined front and back steering provide excellent maneuverability. Three collectors and four refiners are just enough to keep up in refining bits into usable blocks. The um is powered by electric engines, making it a great choice for any nature-conscious mechanic. Just for the record, this miner finished the original flight ground test in about five minutes, but that's not what we're here for. So I move on straight onto the natural rock nodes of different size, with the final tricky one being up on the hill to really put the um to the test. As before, the mining period will last from 0200 in the morning until dark. Rocks don't have to be picked up right away, but only processed materials will count for the total. Today is tomorrow, and the refiners have finished, well, refining. All in all, the um managed to mine 1590 metal and 3360 stone. For a total of 4950 blocks, or 495 rods, 
No machine can reasonably carry it on board. That's why it's important to have enough refiners for the job. With that said, if you have any ideas of how to improve the um or have some designs of your own, share them in the comments below.